guys, I'm back at my nail salon. Um, today I think I'm wearing Punch Pop, by the way. I'm just saying this so that I'll remember. And I am waiting to see my nail lady. She did my toes earlier this week, but it's time for a new set of nails. I was hoping that I could wait a little longer, but um, I have acrylic nails, and so you know, as it grows out, they fill it in. But if the powder, once the it gets older, it, it gets a little more brittle, and my nails, I don't want to flick you off, but this nail broke, and this nail broke, and I'm just delaying the inevitable, and I have uh, things to do this weekend, so I am going to get a new set put on, and they're all looking at me like I've lost my mind. And uh, I brought my nail polish that is in my humongous bag. Hang on, I'm digging. Here it is. I have it on my toes. I never thought I'd wear it on my fingers, but it's so beautiful. This is from the summer collection from Zoya. It's Issa. And I, it's just absolutely gorgeous. I love it. So I think it's going to be very pretty on my fingers and certainly attention getting. So we'll see how long it lasts. But um, I got here early, so I'm just waiting for Jessica to show. And um, I'm excited to get a fresh set of nails. Hey guys, I got my nails done. New set. Isn't they pretty? I mean, they're just, they go with my outfit. So pretty. Okay, um, I am in the parking lot at. Um, not my local, well it is my, so the H-E-B grocery store near my house is sorry, a smaller neighborhood grocery store and then the one that used to be my neighborhood one is a super store and their cosmetic section is amazing and you've heard me talk about that before. But anyway, what's new is that H-E-B um, reached out to me and asked if I wanted to help promote their beauty department and their beauty finds of the month and all that and they sent me a couple gift cards and asked me to go shopping and show people what you can buy at H-E-B. So I didn't feel like telling them I already do that. They didn't need to pay me, but um, always more fun to spend someone else's money. So I'm going to go find some, I'm just, I don't know, let's go see what we got. I'm excited. I love, like, H-E-B in particular, these are all drugstore finds, but H-E-B in particular does carry like Smashbox, and that, but I'm going to keep it to the normal drugstore type brand, or in this case, grocery store. So I'll see you inside. Hey guys, I am waiting to get a phone call from a friend of mine. Her husband's going in for surgery and I'm gonna go keep her company for a little bit while she waits for him to get out. And so I'm just kind of waiting. I brought packed some snacks for her. I just wanna show you my little grocery store haul. So I had $100 to spend. And let me get this mess out of the way, okay. And uh, I hit $98.12. So that's amazing and kind of disheartening that this is all I got. So I got the new, relatively new L'Oreal La Palette nude one that I just saw Lisa Eldridge use in a video, so that makes me feel good. I got a slightly darker shade of CoverGirl I'll Last Day Fabulous 3-in-1 Foundation in the shade A20 because they don't have the new one that I've heard there are mixed reviews on. And this is more my summer color, sadly, yes, summer color. Um, I picked up an eyeliner. I don't want to go through the whole thing because you're going to see it again in a video or will have by the time this airs. I'm wearing, I got two of these in two different colors and I'm wearing one right now. Look at this. Is this not the cutest? Anyway, this is $100 worth of makeup. Just about. Kind of sad. I mean, this set me back 20 bucks, so to be fair. But anyway, so I'm just waiting. There's really not enough time to start um, doing anything else while I wait for my friend to call. So I have grabbed my ever trusty iPad. I'm going to read a little bit. I'm reading, <laughs> I hate recommending books to you because they're always in a series. I rarely read like a standalone book that we can all read along together. So 
I am reading the latest in a series. It's a Dog Lovers Mysteries is the series and the author is Susan Conant. I will link the first one below. I'm reading book 20 and I realized that I don't think I read book 19, so I'm gonna have to go back. But anyway, Bosley's having his nap. I'm gonna wait. He's due to go in any minute now and I'm only like six minutes away from the hospital, so that's not too bad. So I'll see you later, maybe from the hospital. I just got a package. Why did, am I in a cave? I'm in a cave. Okay, there we go. We don't turn on our lights a lot, I have to say, because it's usually really hot outside, and so the overhead lights being on just adds to the heat. Did you want to say something? No. Okay. I just got a package from, um, oh my god, my lips, from <laughs> Soap and Glory, and I'm trying this Pillow Plump. Okay, they don't look any plumper. Do they look any plumper? No. Okay. I wouldn't have. Um, lip swell. This is the weirdest feeling. It l literally feels like when your foot falls asleep and the pins and needles come in. I feel like I have pins and needles in my mouth. I don't know. This is an odd, odd, odd feeling. And I got some other goodies that I can't wait to try. Um, but the one that I'm really excited about, because my name is not normal, is, look, my name. So happy. Okay, wow. Seriously, lips tingling. Like, let me look in the mirror. They don't look any bigger. That's weird. Huh, alrighty then. Awesome. 